Nine on Z. Good evening once again. Good to have you along here at Nine on the Z tonight. I'm David Oliver. In the news, professional golf can certainly be a dream job for a lot of people, but traveling and staying at hotels week after week could probably be exhausting. Well, that weekend, Color 10's Francis Lynn spoke to some people at the Price Cutter Charity Championship Golf Tournament about people who host the golfers here in Springfield. Francis. Well, David, people from all over Springfield are hosting golfers traveling to this tournament this week from around the world. Not only do they save money, but they also get to be a part of a home instead of a hotel room. Those ho hotel walls tend to get a little tight on you week after week, and it's just nice to be in a home and maybe have a home-cooked meal here or there. Grant Hirschman is staying with a host family this week and says it's been a great experience. If you do it every week, it, it really saves because it's saving, obviously, the hotel costs. And then, like I said, a few meals here and there because their host families are usually super nice and awesome and love to cook for you. So that saves a little bit as well, and you add it up after the weeks and ends up saving quite a bit of money. It's a great savings for them. I mean, they're in hotels week after week after week. And these are the up-and-comers. These are the people that are trying to get to the PGA Tour. And, uh, and uh, at this point, they're not making a great deal of money. That's why private housing is very important to them. They're trying to keep their cost, uh, their expenses as low as possible. Executive Director Gerald Andrews says there are always a lot of host families in town ready to help out. Springfield has always been very gracious to roll out the red carpet for the uh, young players as they come into town. Many of them with wives, uh, some with children, uh, some with many of them with caddies. We're a tournament who li likes to try to house caddies also. So we have players in homes, players and wives, player and caddy. Some have many caddies, many two or three players. Housing coordinator Marsha Mankin says, as a host, they have a lot of fun too. And they talk and they help and they pet the dog and they do the dish. I mean, they'll do anything. They'll sleep on blow-up beds. They just absolutely love it, and they're delightful. Plus, she says host families develop great relationships with the golfers as well. They get to know a, a golfer, and they're great young men. You know, they may be the next great golfer. Whoever your idol golfer is, they may be the next great golfer. And we've had that happen in Springfield before. Host families are great. They save a lot of costs for you, and it's just nicer in general. I mean, we're always on the road. We don't get to really be in a house or a family atmosphere very much, so it's nice to be, be around a family and get treated like you're part of the family. If you want to sign up to become a host next year, there are instructions on how to do that on our website, OzarksFirst.com. All right, Francis.